Three. I'm afraid because I checked out the cord. Steel reinforcements. There's nothing to be afraid of. I can be fearless. Whoa. My name is Father Dan O'Connell. I was ordained a priest of the Archdiocese of Boston in 1983. Once we know we're on you, yeah. I would put your foot down. It's just, it will be less complicated. Okay. That way, because right. um, it might introduce, because the, the screen was moving a little it bit. Was, yeah, well, I was falling and, over yeah. on the one foot. Because, I was because we're posting it, I'm not sure. Okay. Great! Uh, you should see the You know, the whole notion of priesthood was always in my head, but um, I was a little afraid of it. You know, I, I didn't know if I was really the, the man for the job. So I went off and got a job, uh, worked for an insurance company for many, many years, and would sit at my desk uh, looking out the window at the Charles River during springtime with the sailboats. And I would just always feel that there was something more to life than sitting in that office approving loans. And so I decided that I would give the seminary a try. And, and, and so as soon as I went to the seminary, I could really feel that that was the direction that the Lord was calling me in. And, and I've been here ever since. <laughs> Is the lighting changed from usual? It seems brighter to me. It did it yesterday. Be. Okay. Huh? It could be. Well, here in Boston, um, we've, we've had actually the longest running live daily mass in the history of, of TV anywhere. And so as a newly ordained priest, I was invited to celebrate that mass. Well, the director of the station one day was sitting in his office and put the mass on and I was celebrating it. And they had wanted to get a show geared toward young people off the ground for many years. And so I was asked to come in and kind of uh, do a bit of a, a screen test, for lack of a better term. And uh, I guess I, I passed because we started shooting the show called We've Got to Talk. Um, literally, we shot the pilot in 1989 and the show aired for the first time in 1990 and has been on ever since. Father Dan O'Connell is back with new episodes of the long-running Catholic TV series, We've Got to Talk. How can we be open to allowing the Lord Jesus to redirect us, especially when we might be going down a wrong path? Join Father Dan as he shares examples from everyday life to bring viewers a unique perspective on our faith. We've Got to Talk is right here on Catholic TV. Beginning the show with kind of a, a crazy five minute opening to kind of grab people's attention as a reminder to them that um, God is at work, Jesus is at work in all of our lives all of the time. Whether we are at work, uh, hanging from a bungee cord, jumping out of an airplane. Whoa, whoa, I, I, I can't look down. I, I, I can't look down. I, whoa, this is so far up. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know how I get myself into these things. Three, two, one. I saw the building and I was able to get my bearings. You know, we human beings are always searching for something to help us be who we are. And if you can present a show reminding people that the Lord is indeed there to help them through challenging times, to celebrate with them when things are going well, um, there's a great attraction to that. People really are searching for deeper things in their life. On every single table, somebody has crowns. Why do we have, why do we have crowns today? Um, because it's, because... Well, it's a feast day. I would hope that anyone who, who hears me preach uh, the Word of God, whether they hear me at a retreat in their parish, whether they hear me preaching on a Sunday in this parish, or whether they're lying on their couch one night and put on the TV and see the guy with the loud sweater doing some crazy thing, I would hope that they would hear, one, that, that I truly love my work, and I would hope that that would deepen their love for God that if we turn to him, he is right there 24-7 to give us exactly what we need to get through anything that life might throw at us. And sometimes life can throw some pretty crazy, unexpected things at us. All we need to do is trust. Till next time, I'm Father Dan O'Connell, and this is We've Got to Talk.